We are going in for our the needle. That's so what funny. Is it? COVID yeah. vaccine. So, beware. <laughs> We're nervous, but excited. We're terrified. <laughs> hey guys, it's me and Rodney here to tell you that we took the vaccine today. How do you feel? I feel pretty good. I feel excellent, actually. I'm glad I did. Good. I feel good too. Um, I guess the only thing that I could say is that my arm is killing me, but I'm about to take a Tylenol, so it's Rodney. Yeah, my arm is not really hurting that much. It's just tender from a normal shot. Um, but I do have Tylenol on deck. But uh, yeah, it's just, you know. <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's just normal shot pain, like a normal flu shot. Yes. Pain, but. So we advise you to go out and get vaccine, vaccinated if your hospital offers it or if your job offers it. It's not a problem. Just go get it done. Right. Bye. Bye. Whew. Hey, guys. Just got off of work. It's 4.57 p.m. Um, I'm about almost six hours out from getting my COVID-19 vaccine. Right now, I'm feeling fine. Right when you got the shot, there was a little bit of burning um, when the medicine went in. Um, kind of like when you have your tetanus shot, um, for those who've had one. Um, and of course, right now, there's a little bit of pain at the site. But I took some Tylenol about in 20 minutes ago. Went all day without it, but started to kind of get tight on me. So anyway, this is day one. It's 4.57. I got my shot around 10 minutes to 11. Um, so yeah, I'm going to do some daily updates so that you guys know how I'm feeling, if I had any reaction, but keep in mind, everybody's reaction is probably different. There's different things going on in people's bodies. So, um, you know, by far not a complete professional opinion, but I just want you guys to know what to expect. Um, when you get this, you know, keep you informed, keep watching. Hey guys, it's Morel. Um, I just wanted to do this video really quickly let you know that it's day two um since i've gotten my um covid vaccine feeling good today i um, just having a little bit of sight pain from when i got the shot um so it was really hard to sleep on this side yesterday i um, gonna take some a leave or something this morning um after i drink my coffee and um but other than that, I don't have anything else of significance to um, say. I, I'm, I feel fine. Um, and I'm not doing these videos to convince anybody to go get the vaccine. Um, it's everybody's personal choice, just like it was my personal choice to get vaccinated. But, um, you know, we all have different reasons why we do or don't want to get it done. Hey, good morning. Um, it's 11 o'clock and I just wanted to video uh my day three um folding some clothes here <laughs> um and i'm off of work today but um yesterday i had a little bit of arm pain today upon touching it i can feel some arm pain but other than that it's going away um and i haven't had any symptoms I think sometimes like when other people have told me that they've had symptoms i start like looking for stuff and then i'm like oh wait I do kind of feel a tingleness, ting, tingliness in my throat or, you know, I, it is a little hard to breathe, but I think it's just your mind. <laughs> but um, so far, so good today. I'm doing well. And um, yeah, if anything changes, I will let you guys know. Hey, what's up guys? Um, this is day six from when I got my um, vaccine. Feeling good. Um, nothing of significance that I can even talk about. Um, one thing that I kind of did notice maybe by the fourth day was I was itching on my arm. And I don't know if that's just from it getting cool outside and it's getting dry or you know it's just from the shot but i don't know it wasn't really at the site that i got um my shot it was just my arm was itching so 
um both arms actually so i don't know i don't know if that has anything to do with me getting the vaccine but i just wanted to say that because i did notice that and i'm usually my arms are usually not itching so that's new but anyway other than that i'm fine i'm alive um and you know hopefully if you're thinking about getting the vaccine um you make your own decision you don't let anybody influence you um i didn't i just went home and was thinking like um because my job they did a lottery and uh you just signed up and they would contact you if you know they had enough vaccines but um the day that i thought about doing it i walked into work and somebody was like you know they kind of have a clinic where you can just walk in and get it done I walked in got it done with my co-workers and I think that same day I got an email saying that I had won the lottery and to go get it done so anyway we got it done and it was quick uh like I said the initial thing was that it was just some burning going on and so you know now you know I'm just trying to track my symptoms but nothing of significance has gone on so I'm excited about that um anyway so hopefully um you know you can make an informed decision whether or not to get your vaccine and I hope that you know your job or um somebody's offering it to you maybe your doctor's office I don't know how that's being rolled out um i just know since i work in the emergency room um i probably definitely needed it uh because we get a lot of patients in there who actually have the virus so um yeah that's crucial so anyway hope you enjoyed this video if you haven't already please 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 um like and subscribe um i have more videos to come um y'all it's 2021 this is crazy <laughs> i've been videoing since last week with this video <laughs> so right now it's monday january 4th um i worked um saturday this weekend because um i was off thursday and so i feel like i didn't get really no time off but that's okay i will survive um anyway stay tuned for my next video and uh thank you so much for tuning in